Hi everyone and welcome to a brand new video in my YouTube channel. As you've already seen the title of the video, you know what I'm going to do, but still let me show you this. Some old baskets that I have. Let me take it out and show you. So, these are some old baskets that I have here. I had done a small DIY with this basket and using it in one of the bathrooms but I didn't really show you because it was something very simple and nothing great to show. This has been a waste paper basket and I didn't want to really spoil this basket just using it for a waste paper basket so I'm going to do a DIY on this. I'll show you what all we do. and. And these are two small similar baskets that I have. I purchased these from Shillong and I think they both costed me uh, 100 rupees each. So if you're visiting Shillong, you can definitely get these. They're very nice and handy baskets. I'll show you how I do up these baskets and how I'm going to use them. So at the moment, these are what we have. And without any further delay, let's start the DIY. Some varnish, some cloth, Blush. let's start. Clean up the basket properly. So I'm going to use this varnish. You must have seen me using this for my other projects too. Okay, take a cloth, any old cotton cloth, dip it in the varnish. You can even use a brush if that's what you find more convenient. Apply the varnish evenly on all sides. already looking good you can see the difference here I'll be putting about two coats of varnish okay so we are done with this okay now I'm going to spray paint this basket with white color this is what I'm going to use and make sure to use a face mask now the surface is clean i'm just going to shake this up and start painting it spray it evenly on all sides even this basket will need two coats of painting okay since i don't have much time and i want to finish up this project I'm just blow drying it with the hair dryer. Okay, it's nice and dry now. I can start applying the second coat now. Okay, so we are done with the second coating also. Now let's leave this to dry. I kept them in the sun for a day and now it's ready. So let's start up with this basket first. Okay, so I'm just using a hot glue gun and I'm going to stick this ribbon around. For this decor video, I'm going to show you a Christmas theme. So accordingly, I'm putting this ribbon around the basket. Okay, that's done. Looks good already. Some more hot glue gun here. And here I'll be pasting some old uh, Christmas decor that I had. Like for example, this ball and the ribbon. Looks cute. I think I can add some more things here. Anyways, before that, let's do the bottom side. Again, I'm putting the same ribbon like that. I have these 
old pine cones. I think I can just add them up here. It'll give a better look. Okay. Let me see what else I have. Okay, I can use this ball here. Just gently stick it using a glue gun. It's looking good already. Some hollies, artificial ones. Okay. And that's done. Okay, now let me show you how I'm going to use this. I'll place it here. And in goes some magazines. And that's a cute little magazine holder. How do you like this? Please do let me know in the comment section below. So for the second basket, as you've seen, I've already painted it white. It's nice and dry now. And I'll be using the satin ribbon first. Please ignore my table. It's really messy today. I'm just stitching it up like this with a white thread. So this is what we are doing and this is going to take time. So I'll have to ask someone to do it for me. In the meantime, I've got this red satin ribbon and we're going to fix it here on the handle using this fevicol. Just giving it some gap and taking it around the handle. I'll cut it here and also stick this part with a fevicol. Okay, and that's done. It's looking cute. Now let's move on to the next step. Okay, so I stitched up this ribbon and made it a little frilly. And we're going to stick it up here again using the hot glue gun. I'm applying the hot glue here. And now I'm sticking the satin frill that I made. Okay, now stick it all right round. This is going to look so pretty. Okay, now that's done. Fix it up properly. This is done. Okay, looks cute already. Now, I'm going to give it some life, a little bright color. As you know, this is a Christmas decor that we are doing. Stick it right round. Okay, so we are done with this also. So here I have some white beads and I'm going to stick them on this part. Again, I'm sticking it up using the hot glue. Okay, so this is how it looks now. Done. Some more beads to go on the upper portion of the basket. Here I'm using the smaller size beads. Take a closer look. I'm fixing them up like this. I'll show you the finished work later. Here again, I'm going to fix some broader satin ribbon, the red color, just below this white frill to give it some contrast. Fixing it up again using the hot glue gun. Okay, that's done. And this is how it looks. We are not yet done with this project. There's more to go, so keep watching. I made a similar satin frill with the ribbon and I'm going to stick it here again. This is also done. Now moving on to the next step. I'm going to stick some more red satin ribbon here. And we're done with that as well. 
Now some more bead work. Okay, that's done. Now time to decorate the handle as well. I'm sticking the smaller beads on the red satin ribbon, the white beads. Moving on to the next step, I'll tie a bow on both the sides here. Now time to reveal, this is the final look of the white basket. Please do let me know how you like this basket in the comment section below. Okay, now the next basket. This decor is done by my mom when we were in Calcutta. Isn't this pretty? Do let me know what you think about this basket decor as well. And now the last one. Please let me know in the comment section below which was your favorite basket. Thank you all so much for watching. We'll be back with an interesting video very soon. Till then, do take good care of yourself. Bye.